Year three is a wrap on our homestead. It is so crazy to think we moved out here January 10th, 2020, and so much has changed since just not even having a road into the property to what it is now. It has been such a fast year, such a crazy year, it's hard for me to even comprehend the amount of things we have done this year, but we're gonna get into it. We're gonna show you guys kind of a year in the Terraform homestead. Thank you guys for watching. Let's get into it. Grow your garden, find your tribe. Let your hearts burn inside. Move your body towards the light. I started this year by refreshing a few old homes. In all of its travels and everything, we ended up sustaining some damage to it that made it not roadworthy. So we finally found it its permanent home and currently what we're working on is making it a four season home. I am really loving how it came out. and building a few new ones. We dialed in our community. One of the things that's important in our space is to create a opportunity for people to create and express themselves where they normally wouldn't. So we've created a little art gallery in our community spaces where people do murals, different artwork, things like that. Learn some new skills. What are you doing? Getting grass. Oh loading grass into the truck to take it out to the desert. Oh. And a lot about how not to do things. Yeah, see, it's, it's wanting to slope that way. Research. No idea what they're doing. But it looks pretty. Yeah. I further connected with our land and all the residents of it. Sneaky snake over here. I don't think you're supposed to be there. And truly saw the power the desert. <laughs> this is insane. We finished our pump house. We built a workshop from scratch. It's an opportunity which is what I'm telling myself so I don't cry. Put a roof on our test house. Started the forever home. Finally, finally achieved power security by upgrading our bare bone solar system to a properly sized one. We collaborated with other builders and neighbors, asked for help, and finally accepted that I can't do everything on my own. I realized it's important to take time off. So I made it to France. Even if taking time off means walking 650 miles across the country. Mm -hmm. 
just to say I did it. I reconnected with my art and it built a beautiful workshop, a sacred space for creativity. This thing's amazing. It made things I never thought I could make. Twenty twenty two is really a start over, a new chapter in my life. It was a place to slow down, uh, to start reconnecting with what's important in life, uh, what my missions are, what our goals are here at the homestead, to slow down and just realize that we're not in survival mode anymore, that we have the space and freedom to really kind of do some more interesting projects that take a little bit more time that aren't necessarily to, you know, get water or get electricity or things of those nature. So uh, 2022 is really a great year to finally feel like we got our feet under us. To the hundreds of people who have been part of this community over the last three years, I want to give a very special thank you to each and every one of you. Everyone who's come through here has left something, made something, made an impact on how this place has been shaped. This is not a project that one person can do on their own. So it's been so amazing to host over 150 people in the last three years, to see people change, to see people grow, and to really have a change of perspective in life. To the thousands of y'all that are out there watching these videos every week, sending messages, supporting our YouTube channel, our nonprofit through, you know, any means you can. It means a lot. It is so exciting to see this community grow and to build something that people are actually inspired by and reach out to me and say, hey, can we come check out your place? We love what you're doing, that kind of thing. So to everybody that's watching and supporting and watching right now, thank you guys for doing this. Um, it means a lot to me. It means a lot to this community. And y'all are really what helps this thing grow. So, you know, very, very, very thankful for all of that. 2023, we've got a lot of big projects coming up. We are not slowing down at all. We're gonna be working, finishing out our test house, hopefully pushing on our big house. So many more projects uh, to get done. I can guarantee it's gonna be a fun year, a good learning experience, a lot of hard lessons, like every year that we have out here, but it's gonna be a lot of fun. I'm so excited to bring new content to you guys every week coming up in 2023 to continue just growing this place and really focusing in on what is important and that is sustainable living out here and sustainable living education. We are hoping to make 2023 the biggest year we've had out here and really refocus on Terraform Together as a nonprofit, as an educational source and grow. So, so excited to be bringing you guys more content. Thank you guys for watching this episode. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing just how much things can change over a year. It has been amazing to me to see this progression, um, <laughs> to be filming in a workshop that we didn't even have thoughts of building six months ago. It's just so amazing to see how this place has grown over the last three years and to finally feel like we have our feet under us. Appreciate you guys watching. We'll have something fun for you next week. Go build something cool. Raising up a new world from the ground.